Hi. 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 Are you ready to follow the floating ball? I am. I'm Erica Bowserman. And I'm Joan Whitson. And we're with the Early Learning Coalition of North Florida. Today, we're going to show you a fun science experiment to do with kids to teach them about the concept of air. This is actually the second in our four video series about air. Whoa, so welcome to the infamous ping pong ball and blow dryer science experiment. Ooh. Whoa, so this experiment should be done by an adult or grown up because you are using an electrical appliance. So supplies needed, a hair dryer with an adequate flat nozzle to hold not one, but hopefully two ping pong balls. All right. Look at this. That's all I we need. It. And ping pong balls of different colors. Okay. So, Joan, can you tell me what the word hypothesis means? Ooh, that is a very good scientific word. And as we're trying to teach kids about science, we want them to learn these important words. And a hypothesis is simply just making a prediction about what will happen. So in this case, we want to ask the kids their prediction about what they think will happen with the ping pong ball when we turn the hole dryer on top of it. Will it float up in the air or will it not? And we're gonna ask them why. And I would suggest writing down their predictions. Okay, very good. All right, let's start. So first you take the hair dryer okay. and you point it upwards and you make sure that your setting is on cool or warm okay. and your speed is on high. We do not want to burn any of these <laughs> ping pong balls, okay? So first I'm going to put this ping pong ball on and guess what's going to happen? I'm going to pop it in the middle and turn it on. Woo! Yeah! Look at it. It's Look at floating. It. Is it floating? It is. It's Look at it. Whoa. Okay. So that was pretty cool. That was right? awesome. All right. So now the next trick is I am going to put this red one on here and balance this green one on here. Ooh, Hopefully. two. Two. You got this. Are you ready? I am. And we're gonna see what happens. Whoa! Oh my goodness! What, no, okay, wait. Okay, this, okay, we're gonna try this again. They started to spin they and, and rotate. They did start to spin, but I'm gonna dry this again. Okay, you got this. I got this, because what's gonna happen? Okay, ready? Yeah. Here we go. Whoa! Oh, look at they changing places. They're changing places. So, I have another way of doing this in case you want to try it this way. Okay. Sometimes it works, but it's always good to have a backup point. Mm -hmm. Okay? So here we go. I'm going to do this. Send this one. Look at oh, that! Look at that! They're dancing! They're so, they are dancing! Look at this with the ease of a trapeze! Woo! Oh my goodness! How does this experiment work? Well, let me tell you, the air from the hair dryer is moving much faster than the air around it. The air is at rest. Okay. So the ping pong ball stays within the column of air of the faster moving air. So the air from the dryer pushes up and the gravity from planet Earth pulls down and the ball sits at a point where those two forces are equal. So now I'm going to do this other thing. I'm going to start this rolling again here. Okay. I, did I use a pink one? We'll use a pink one. Yeah, I like that one. I like that one. So what happened? It, the ball fell, right? Well, why did the ball fall? Because the, it fell to the ground because that you've stopped moving the air fast. Okay. Okay. So now for the wow oh, factor. I love the wow factor. Okay. So take a toilet paper roll, okay. put it on top of the nozzle. Oh, this is going to be good. So I now wonder what's going to happen. I'm going to put this green one in here. Okay. Oh, and I think I like this hot pink one. Oh, and hold be... on to the toilet paper All right. roll. All right. Are you ready, Miss Joe? I'm ready. I'm excited. Here we go. Ready. Go. One, two, three. Whoa! Oh, it has a shot up right even wow! farther than the last time. I know, because Ooh. the air is concentrated in the toilet paper roll, so it shoots up like, much faster. It's like a rocket. Just like a rocket. So now, Miss Joan, guess what you get to do? Oh, I get to it's do it. Turn, turn, turn. I'm so excited. Okay. So okay. I'm going to put this up. Now, oh, hold this okay. on. Hold on. I'll get that. Okay. okay. I'm ready. So I hope now, it... I'm going to give really you fast. one of these green ones. Okay. Ooh, and I think I'll give you a pretty Ooh, yellow. Good. Now, you know what? Let me do this pink one because that Ooh. really shows up cool. Okay. And I got this special one with the little smiley oh, face. Oh, this is that. good. Okay, you ready? Okay. You ready? One, two, two three. three. Whoa! Oh, look at that. Woo! I love it. Wow. 
Wow, Miss just like Shaw, a rocket. I think you're ready for the ping pong Olympics. I am. All right, so the next part of this experiment is called tilt oh. the blow dryer. Tilt, okay. Tilt the hair dryer. So here is where it gets interesting. I am going to use a ping pong ball with dots on it for this part, so hopefully. <laughs> you got it. I got it. I might take me a couple <laughs> of tries. You can see the ball spinning as I do it. Okay. Ready, Miss Jones, so tell them what I'm gonna All do. All right, so Erica's gonna get it going just like she did before, but this time she's gonna turn and move the blow dryer at a four to five degree angle, following the ball slowly back and forth. I'm Watch. In, I'm in the zone. Here she goes. See? And look at how she's tilting it. It's spinning. And it's spinning. It's spinning. Okay, okay no, but she'll get it going again. I'll get it going again. Yeah, no. Okay, yeah. yeah, try it again. She gets it going. And then she's going to tilt it. Oh, there. Okay, it's spinning. All right. And then she's, and then I'm gonna go okay, the she's going to go the other way. And, and it's spinning and again. And it doesn't fall. And it doesn't fall. I know. Look at Why Whoa. doesn't it fall? Oh, my gosh. It does not fall because the air forms a stream around the ball. So as you twist the hair dryer over, okay. you may also notice that the ball starts to spin faster. This is gonna, I'm gonna, let me see. No, okay, but it'll work, trust me on this. So the reason it spins faster is because of its position in the air stream. So it might be a good idea for you yes. to have a blow dryer and a wonderful <laughs> assortment of colored ping pong balls in your classroom. The kids really love this yep. experiment and they want to see it on repeat. So until next time, see this cute little smiley face I have drawn. <laughs> I love on it. Yes, he's ball? cute. You can see it, right? <laughs> okay. So until next time, this gives a new spin to the old saying, smile and have a nice day. Here we go. All right. You ready? Yep. So thanks. I'm going to bring it up here. And Miss <laughs> Joe. And I'm have a great day. And we really hope that you try this experiment in your Whoa! classroom at home. Please subscribe to our ELC of North Florida YouTube channel for more amazing videos like this one. Bye. Smile. Bye.